My name is Robert Boyle, and I'm an attorney here in New York City, and I'm consulting with Attorney Roth on this case. The Fourth Amendment to the United States Constitution protects U.S. citizens from being subjected to unreasonable searches and seizures. That fundamental principle applies to searches and seizures directed toward U.S. citizens by U.S. law enforcement anywhere in the world. The Fourth Amendment's protections were blatantly violated here. The contents of the plaintiff's digital devices was secretly copied by security personnel recruited by the CIA, and then that information was turned over to the CIA. This was all part of a intentional plan. The seizure and copying of the digital information contained in people's devices, you know, it, it does not only violate the plaintiff's rights and tangentially, and we'll get to this more later, Mr. Assange's rights, but think of what we store in our phones and our computers, birthdays, bank information, dates of birth, all of this was recorded and then given over to the Central Intelligence Agency. So the violations of the privacy rights here were particularly egregious. Of course, Mr. Assange's rights, I would submit to a fair trial, have now been tainted, if not destroyed. The recording of meetings with friends, with lawyers, the copying of his attorneys and friends' digital information taints the criminal prosecution because now the government knows the contents of those communications. And there, there should be sanctions, even up to dismissal of those charges or withdrawal of an ex extradition request in response to these blatantly unconstitutional activities. Thank you.